The Heaviside cover-up method will work with uh, more extended versions of these problems as well, at least in some cases. Uh, so here's one, uh, again, this is an example I did in an earlier video, uh, but we had three linear terms in the denominator, okay? And the cover-up method will still work here. Um, so remember, the idea is you find the value that would make your denominator uh, that you're trying to find the constant for zero. So x would be negative two. Uh, that's what would make this denominator zero, okay? So I can't put a negative two in here. I cover up that term, and you just substitute negative two in for everything else. So this one will be a little bit longer. Uh, but you're going to have 5 times negative 2, uh, which is negative 10. Negative 10 plus 7 is negative 3. Um, on the bottom, if you put in negative 2 here, negative 2 minus 2 is negative 3. And if you put in negative 2 here, negative 2 plus 1 is going to be negative 1. Uh, and so you get negative 3 over positive 3, which is equal to positive 1. So that's your A value. A is equal to 1. Okay? And then you just continue with the other terms. So uh, for the other terms here, uh, what would make this denominator here zero? Uh, that would be a value of one. So I cover up the one that would give me a zero term. I put in a one here. Uh, five times one plus seven is 12. One plus two is three. One plus one is two. 12 divided by six is two. And that's my B value. All right. And then finally, I have my C value here. Um, and so same thing, what would make C equal zero in the denominator? That of course would be a value of negative one. Um, so I can take five times negative one plus seven, that would be two. Um, cover up your X plus one term, because that's the one that would be zero. Negative one plus two would give me one in the denominator. Uh, negative one minus one is negative two. Okay, so we've got two over negative two, uh, which is equal to negative one. And uh, that's going to be my value of C. So much faster than some of the other options, although obviously if you forget how the concept works, you can't really do it that way. So, uh, you know, you'll have to decide what you think the best method is for you, but at least it's an option.